Yo, what's good YouTube? Before reacts, back in our video. In today's video, I'm going to be reacting to the Seven Sins album by Philip. It's been highly recommended to react to this album, so I'm finally getting to it. Um, it, be, it was I reacted to um, the Man Who Cries Wolf or something like that. I think it was, and they said to people commenting to react to this album. So I'm going to be reacting to this album, and yeah, I'm going to be doing it on Spotify. Normally, I react to these albums on YouTube. But it's like, I didn't know which order it was all going in, etc. So I decided to come over to Spotify and go to the album and, and react to it through Spotify. Um, so yeah, let's get straight to it. The first song is Foes. So yeah. liking the build up of this so far it's like a rock and roll type feel to it but a very dark demonic type feel to it at the same time which i'm liking with the um with the sound in the background it's like it's like you're going into war type thing you know what i mean This is reminding me of Travis Scott. If you guys know of Travis Scott, this is reminding me a lot of Travis Scott. As soon as he said foes, I was like, whoa, man sounding like Travis Scott right now. This is very different to what Philip normally does, I can't lie. It's a very upbeat type song, and I've never actually heard him rap like this in a song. It's like very slow paced, but the beat is really, really hard, which I'm loving about this so far. And it's just very unique to his style. Like, he, he just doesn't normally do stuff like this. So I think this has given me the thought that he is playing about and testing out new things and trying new things with music and trying to come out of his comfort zone and try different things, which I really like it. I really, really like it. It's being very productive when it comes to the music. No, no. Fuck on a lyrical shit, but I'm kind of in hip hop 
Now we've got a beat change right now. The beat change is very different to what the beat was. Goddamn. But I'm liking it so far. It's such a vibe. <laughs> Okay, so this song I liked. It's very all over the place with like everything just being all combined together. But I'm really liking this. It's very different to what Philip normally does. It's a, it's a good song. Um, I'm definitely going to add it to my playlist. That's for sure. Add it to my like songs for now. But I'll add it to my Joshua's playlist. Um, but we're going to move on to the next song, um, which is going to be Envy. So let's get straight to that. But I'm going to give Foes like an 8.2 out of 10, personally. But yeah, let's get straight over to MV. I'm liking his beat choices. His beat choices are really good. I'm um, I'm a guy for upbeat type beats because I like to get in the zone, you know, like get all the energy, bring up, you know, just bring up the energy in me. And these two songs so far have really upbeat beats and I'm getting all the energy from it, which I'm loving. This is definitely a playlist that I'm going to love for sure. Um, I mean, an album. This is definitely an album I'm going to love for sure. Like, I think I'm going to like all the songs on this. If he, If he's keeping... If he's keeping this type of energy to all of the songs, I'm definitely going to be liking this album. And it's definitely going to be my main go-to album by Philip. But yeah, let's get straight to it. Oh, shit. Fire, but 
Hold on, hold on, man brought up the deep voice, bro. This is what my girl loves about Philip. He loves she loves the deep, deep voice. God damn. Five signs every days in a week. I'm about to switch up, up. Yeah. yeah. I'm about to pass out, yeah. Hold up, wait a minute. I'm about to boys go in the I'm press, but you can't control me. No media, the money me. Hope me I'm gonna let the beat run because this beat is so hype. God damn. That was fire i can't lie that was fire i loved it this is a 10 out of 10 no cap this is a 10 out of 10 bro this is my type of energy right here this is hype i like this song way more than the first one i can't lie this came with the more fire heat to it you know what i mean this is fire i'm adding this to my playlist god damn right next wrath i love the energy in that god damn i'm listening to that again later holy wrath it is Another upbeat, god damn. This this is his most fire album so far that I've heard. Holy. Hang on. Bro switched up the flow, holy Nah, I, I don't even know, I'm losing my words right now this album so far is fire. Yeah, I love this. I'm playing the beat again. I'm, I'm gonna let the beat play through because these beat choices, damn, bro. You guys know what I like, and I now see why you recommended this album to me because this album is right on my lane. This album so far is right on my lane. I'm loving this. Well, it's a day, but you know it's over
God damn, Raph, you're going in my playlist. I'm gonna have to give this lower than the last one now. I'm gonna have to give this a 9.3 out of 10 because it just didn't hit the same energy as the last song. Like, it has the energy in this song, but the last song had the energy, energy, you know what I mean? He kept that energy all the way through it, which was fire. But this song is also fire, which I love this song too, so that's going in my playlist, um, in my like songs as well. But yeah, we're moving on to the next one, which is Greed. Let's get it! Alright, so it's going more melodic now. So the three, three first songs were um, energetic, but I think this is going to be more of a melodic one by what I can hear with the acoustic guitar. God, we're going on a roller coaster. We went from very energetic to now the moods just changed, and you're going into like a sad, deep hole. Again. Like you get how can you, how how does Philip do this? So we go from really energetic to now we're going into like a an acoustic type, sad type song. If it, my love for you. My love for you You make me believe it Just tell me nothing for My love for you My love for you You make me believe it Just tell me nothing for you God, was nice. He's going in with the more singing now, but the, the, the beat is coming in with a bit more energy. He's coming in with the more singing now. But this is a very sad song. Very sad song. But I'm liking the vibe to it, and I'm liking, I'm liking this, like, acoustic type version i'm liking it it's more relaxing guys we both know you've been lying to me so like it's killing myself how to give me the water so flow with natural disasters nothing bro this is reminding me now of an artist i listened to and he is called let me find him um oh what's his name got him somewhere on there oh what's his name what's his name what's his name what's his name He's in my playlist. Um, Baby Yoda. No, not Baby Yoda. Fuck. Oh, I can't think of his name. I thought the artist would come up here, but it's not. Um, but he's reminded me of an artist that I listen to, and I completely forgot the name of him. How can I forget the name of the guy I listen to all the time? How does that even work? Hang on. Hang on, hang on. Whoa. Ah, Faye Yoda. He reminds me of Faye Yoda. If you guys don't know who Faye Yoda is, go check him out. This reminds me a lot of Faye Yoda. Thank you. 
I like this song, I can't lie, I'm putting this in my playlist, but more of a relaxing vibe, this is more of like a chill out vibe, which I like. But yeah, we're going to move on to the next, which is Pride, but I'm going to give Greed, um, I'm going to have to do it a bit lower, because I liked it. I won't listen to it all the time, I'll do it when I'm more into a chill mood, like when I'm feeling a bit low, I'll put that on. So I'll put it more on like a 7 point six in my opinion but it's still a good song you know what i mean that's just my opinion like don't hate me for doing a low low score my opinion is it's not something i would listen to all the time but it's something i would listen to again for sure but yeah we're gonna move on to pride let's get it mm. I don't fight, I do my matter. Okay, so we go from one low song back to the energy. Okay, this one I'm probably gonna keep listening to again as well, the same as the first three songs we reacted to on this. But let's get it. I go too fast, boom, I come on tight I shine so bright, now hurt the slide The attack of love, so rain and slide Fuck the bitch, man, I'm in a shot in a trap when I do, you know I'm cool with it I be good zone, the things that I do, they better say, man, hope you cool with it Hey, fuck it, no, you can now, I'm not gonna mess up, I'm not gonna come out, I'm not gonna come out, I'm not gonna come out, I'm not gonna go for less Keep with this bitch, I'm not impressed Yo, I don't, I'm not impressed. Call your friends, I'm not impressed. That's a whole lot of letters. You might wanna get it. Right. I don't fight, I don't give my time. I'm coming on the H-Wax, you're beside your mind. Find a guy, right? Oh, I like that choppy thing he did the voicey voice. Oh, the ch -ch -ch choppy golly. But I can't lie. Uh, I think if the song before this wasn't in the play in the album, it would have been much better. I think he should have dropped the song before this um, as a single and just kept this whole album just with these energetic songs, in my opinion. Because this is a fire album. But that, that that little song, the song we did before this one, just doesn't really fit in with the album because it's completely different to all of his other songs in the album so far, as all these songs are energetic. But yeah, that's my opinion, but I'm liking this a lot.
Yo, hold on, hold on. I need to go back. I need to put pride in my playlist. Golly. We're going on to Glutony now. Glutony. But um again, a nine point six for the last song. What was it called? Hang on. Pride. For Pride, we're giving a nine point six. I like that song, the energy with it. But now we're going on to Glutony. Let's get it. Can I give it all it? I will load up pain, blacking your thoughts solely. Your life is my canvas pain, blaming yourself non me. Now you get addicted, can I get out of your stuff in the shirt? Like an eternally bottomless pain. You can never get away from this love. You feel when you're falling, you're losing yourself on the road You feel yourself but you'll always be running on low That's a demon, that's a de God, you can actually sing along to this as well Because you, you'll pick up to the flow instantly First time listening to this, I picked up the flow instantly He did the first two lines and I was like Damn, he's going to keep that flow for a minute And then I just went along with it I was able to keep that flow at the same time as him It's just so easy to get hyped to and sing to it's like damn god this is gonna be a high rating for sure you feel like somebody you'll always be running on low that's a demon that's a devil yeah can't go messing not with me slowed it down you can never get away from this love know that you'll never know what's enough you know what i mean he just slowed it right down there which i love when he does that but this is such a hype song god damn but you see what i mean now with the album is if you didn't have that acoustic song and just left it with all the energetic songs it's because it fits in more instead of having the acoustic song in the middle of all these energetic songs you know what i mean you can never get away from this love
I'm in a You tripping, you falling, you're losing yourself on the road. You think? Damn, that was fire. Ten out of ten. Again, that song was just heat. I'm gonna have to add that to my album, uh, to my to my like songs. Now we're going on to lust, 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 lust. But yeah, this is giving me Travis Scott vibes all the way through this album so far. I'm getting full on Travis Scott vibes, and I'm loving it. Bro, when he performs, when Felix performs, he's on stage, you know the crowd is going to go insane. You know the whole crowd is going to be jumping, there's going to be mosh pits, you know it. God, he needs to come and perform down in the UK. Loki, he needs to come to England, you know. He'd have to come and perform at Glastonbury Tour, you know. I'm going to be there, I'm going to be jumping up and down in that crowd. I'm going to try to get front seats and I'm going to be hyped as hell. Let's get it. <laughs> I've been on the road again, no time. You're looking at your phone and shit. Should have been mine, but I don't got a lot for you. Let me tell you, you've been on my mind. Might be for the wrong reasons. I've been waiting to send me your location, No This is the slower song again. We've got two slow songs in this, but this one is better than the first slow song. This is better than the fourth song in this album. This is, um, it's slow, but it's still got like the hype energy to it with the beat. So, yeah, but it's much slower, which I'm liking. I'm liking this one. For the wrong reasons, I've been waiting to send me your location, please. No worries, no need to be afraid. Should have lost it, should have satisfied. Come over, come over, babe. This is Sarah Gwymph. I'm guessing she's Welsh. Because Gwymph is very Welsh. And as a Welshman, Gwymph is Welsh. So, I'm guessing she's Welsh, but I don't know. Unless she's... In the same place as Philip, but with a Welsh name, which wouldn't make sense, but yeah. Wanna have a good time, what a bad guy. What I hate about just what I like. Could have get less as long as we vibe. Could have been nice, but you give a mix signs, baby. Come me, gotta give me time. Come me, be here by nine. Uh, uh, uh. No, you got your thoughts, baby, how you feel. Feel the crazy tension, baby, I'm for real. I saw you lying in my bed I'm still wanting more So baby, tell me what's the deal With you want me Come over, come over Is Philip trying to Trying to flirt with Syra right now? Is there something going on between these two? Because Something is getting freaky in here It's getting very freaky in here Golly Philip Got my eye on you bro but she, this this girl, she has got a nice voice. I'm still wanting more, so baby, tell me what's the deal with you want me? Come over, come over, babe. Drop a pin now, it's on my ATA. You can just ain't got no time to waste. Away. 
this is a good song as well. I like this. 10 out of 10. This is going on my sexual playlist. Wait, I shouldn't have leaked that information. But yes, I've got a sexual playlist where I put all the sexual type songs. For reasons. Which I'm not going to get into. But this is going on my sexual playlist. But anyways, that's in my likes playlist for now. Um, we're going on to the next, which is Sloth, which I have reacted a live on Wish performance to Sloth. So we're going to react to the actual song now, not the Wish performance. We're going to react to the actual song, so let's get to it. In the camera raw, it's all Yo, wish you on a car Ignore it, if it's not about you You can take all my time, my time is my life My life will come in time, tell me will you take my yeah. life this time yeah. 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 Right there where he said my life will come in time, tell me will you take my life this time Reminds me a lot of Lil Peep and if you know I am a Lil Peep fan I've got a Lil Peep tattoo on me um, This just, that just reminded me of Lil Peep and um, Lil Tracy Lil Peep and Lil Tracy were best mates that made songs together This just reminded me of Lil Peep and Lil Tracy But I'm liking it Definitely on my lane. My life, my level coming sign. Tell me, will you take my life this time? I feel like you, you. I'm feeling like I'm dead. What to do? If you don't want to stay, I want to go. I know, I know, yeah. I really tried hard, you know. I stopped looking back at you for a minute. I lost track, put me back up on my lady. Take me back to the side, pull it, Peter. Of course, I know the lyrics to this song because I obviously reacted to the live on Wish performance to this, and I did like this song, so this is definitely going on my playlist, and it is a 10 out of 10 either way, so yeah. I think I have heard this one because I think my missus went through this playlist at one point around me and she played this song, so yeah.
Yeah, my missus plays this song all the time. Um, because obviously she deals with depression and that. And she, every time she's depressed, she plays this song. So I've had, she's had this song on repeat one time. So I know this song. Personally, I don't like this type of music. Only because I've moved away from that stage in life. That I don't want to go back to that stage in life. It's a good song and all. But personally, not for me. Because I don't want to have to listen to this. And then it'll take me back to those times that I was in. So, yeah. But I'm going to listen to this anyway. So, yeah. song it's yeah it just brings back those times you know what I mean but yeah but he has got such a beautiful voice he has got an amazing voice it's yeah I just can't really say much about this song because it's a very relatable song I can't lie it is a very relatable song Spaced out. Shit. My bad, guys. Um, I just, yeah. I, I don't know. Thoughts are thoughts are going through my head. <laughs> I got a lot of thoughts going in my head. My my bias is coming back to me. But yeah, this this song is just so relatable. It's like it's like I don't I don't even know what to say. I really don't know what to say. <laughs> Tomorrow, 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 
Wow, it's a beautiful song, very relatable. I'm not going to add that one to it, even though it's in my playlist, because my missus listens to it. Um, so I'm going to keep it in my playlist for her. I'm going to add Sloth to my playlist. Um, I won't be listening to that song again unless I hit rock bottom, like I have in the past. If I hit rock bottom, rock bottom again, I'll probably listen to this song again. But not wise, not wise I'm in the mind I am with the positive energy and I'm enjoying life at the moment, etc. So... I'm not going to go back to that song, but all the other songs in this I liked. Um, but if you enjoyed this reaction, please do like, subscribe, comment down below what I should react to next. Check out all of my socials, my links will be down in the description below. And apart from that, I hope you loved this album reaction. My first ever one doing a full album reaction, so yeah. But I'll see you in the next video. Peace.